Welcome to my new video. In this tutorial I will explain you step by step how to create a package with procedure and a function. For more details and the code which is used in this tutorial, check out the link in the video description to my blog post. So let's get started. First of all we will open here over the SQL workshop the SQL command. I have prepared some code, so I will paste here. For the package specification, we need here this code. So with this two line, we can create only the specification. If I press the control enter button, then you can see the package is created, but it will be empty package specification. So I can go here to the object browser and open this package. Then you can see we have currently only the specification, but without any procedure or function. What is the function doing? The function a user can give to the function three different values. Also one value will be capital, one value will be the since rate and the, and the third value is the year. Later I will also tell you the logic about this. But here for the first in the specification we define only yeah, the, par the function name and also the, the parameter and the read. Yeah. Then I copy the procedure and will also paste here and explain you. As you can see, this is the procedure, the name beginning with the PR. We have also here two different parameters, customer name and report date. The data types are varchar and date. Now if I click on the control enter button, then you can see the package is created and we can go here to the object browser and refresh the page. And then we will see here, we have here now two different objects. So now what we can do is create the body because it's currently empty. The main logic will be also created here in the body. So I go back here in the SQL command, delete this all and will paste the another code. So here is our fully code of the body. So from, from the package body, we have here our function is the same like specification. But what is new is that we have here declared one variable. Calculation with the data type number. This variable will have the value from here. This is our calculation. And if we have a look in the calculation, then we can see the capital is one parameter. We have here the since is one parameter and we have the years. This is also one parameter. So after this calculation is done, the value will be saved on this variable. And then the value of this variable will be returned by this, by this function. So we move to the procedure. We have also by the procedure, these two parameter. There is no logic. What we are doing is only give these three lines on the terminal and yeah, say report for, report for customer name. Also this is the parameter. And then we have your report date. Also this is the parameter. And that's all. I press control enter and the package body is created. We go here, make a refresh. And then we can see we have now here code in the package body. Um, now you have seen how we can create the package specification and package body. In the next step, we will run this function. And for this, we will open here the SQL command and enter a new code. So then as I explained you before, this function have a return value. Also in the beginning, we write here our package name. And then in the second uh, position, we type here the function name. These are the different parameter and for example we have 1000 euro we want the five percent in three years so we will find out how many um, since will we get after three years so this function will give us a return value the return value will be saved in this variable which is declared here and then we make here output on the line we will see on the results this line for the output so i will press control enter and can see interest amount is 157 so for example if i double my amount and i have seven percent for two years and i press control enter then i see okay my amount change 289 euro so with this function we can enter some value over the parameter and will get as a return a value number this is the target of this function. Now I will show you how to run the second procedure. Here is the code. And we define in the first parameter the name, Max Mustermann, and our 
second value in the parameter is the current date, also this date. Yeah, if I press Control and Enter, then I see report for Max Mustermann, report date is this, and thank you for using our service, what we have defined here. So in this tutorial, you have seen how to create a package with function and procedure and how you can call these from the SQL command. That's all for this video. I hope it was helpful and you are now able to do this. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. Thanks for watching.